Hola. Um, I am I am here with a with a video explanation of um, how to access the folders on Edmodo. So I'm going to begin by signing in as a student. That way, my screen will look a little bit more like your screen. And so we sign in, and of course, uh, I have a different picture there, but um, this looks a lot more like your screen than mine. You have your home, the progress, and your backpack. So one of the ways that you can uh, take advantage of some of the um, links and websites and apps that I've shared with you is to access the folders. So to get to the folders that I have shared with you, you just click on your teacher's name. Uh, you might note that I am a member of both Ms. Felkers, Mrs. Felkers, and Ms. Bosco's group, but that would not be the case with you. Um, if you're in Mrs. Felker's class, you're only going to see Estudiantes de Señora Felker. If you're in Ms. Bosco's class, you'll only see Estudiantes de Señora, Señorita Bosco. And if you're a, a member of the Spanish club, of course, you're in, in this area. So to get to your folder, just click on your class name. Click on folders. And here are all the folders that I have shared with you. And you can explore these on your own. Um, these are some um, things I've put in here. Uh, that's that video that I showed to you at one point about how to use Edmodo. This is a dictionary. Um, there's some of the videos that I have made for the class as well as some things that I showed you that Fernando video. So if you ever want to get back to those, that is exactly how you do it. If you're in Miss Bosco's class, you, of course you won't see Mrs. Felker's class. You'll just see Miss Bosco's. You do the same thing. Click on um, your group name and then on folders. And again, you'll have the same exact folders as Miss Bosco. And if you're wondering if the Club de Español has that as well, exactly the same. So one of the things that you can do if you go into, let's say you're a student in Mrs. Mrs. Felker's class, go into the folders, you find something you really like, um, you went to Votapic, you really liked it, and um, if, you, if you don't know what it is, you can just go to it and it will open it in a brand new window for you and then you can um, play around with it and when you're done with it, you can just close that window. One of the things you might notice is over here, it has this little backpack thing that looks like that thing. So I have um, added these two links to my backpack already, but I don't have, this is for Raz Kids, I don't have this in my backpack. So I'm going to add that to my backpack. And I am in Mrs. Felker's class. So I'm going to go to my backpack and see if it went in there or not. In Mrs. Felker's class, and here are my items, the one I just added and the ones that were there already. So if you wanted to um, add any of those to your backpack, it's really easy to do that as well. So once again, click on your teacher's name, click on the folders, and click on the folder, whichever folder you want to open, and add it to your backpack, or just play it and decide if you want to put it in your backpack or not. And that's how you add um, stuff to your own backpack, but it's also how you access the folders that I have shared with you. I hope that was helpful. I'll see you in class. Adios.